When it comes to making cocktails, measuring out your ingredients and being super accurate is so important these days because you don't want to make a rubbish cocktail, do you? But you also don't want to look dull and boring while you're making them. Step forward, Barfly's new jiggers. I've spoken about the sort of brother or the sister to this. This one's a little bit better. If you're one of these people that doesn't like to get sticky fingers, why not check out the Barfly stepped jigger? They've got little handles, look. How cool is that? They've got little handles. So you can even have a little tipple while you're, while you're making them. Uh, but they come in three different colors. This is the kind of normal traditional stainless steel one, the sort of silver, whatever you want to call it. We've got the gold one and we've got the copper one there. Now, there is a point to note, these are in uh, two ounces. They're two ounces. I talk about two ounces quite a lot. I like working in, U in, in US kind of ounces, one ounce, two ounces, but they do kind of translate into mil quite easily. Two ounces, 60 mil, one ounce is 30 mil, but never fear, never fear, because these, with the step jiggers, I will show you inside in a second, but with the step jiggers, not only are they kind of marked on one side in, what's what we got there? We've got mil in there, so we've got 15 mil, we've got 30 mil, we've got 45 mil and 60 mil up to the brim. But on the reverse, we've got it the other way. So we've got half an ounce, one ounce, uh, one and a half ounces, two ounces. But you can sort of see inside there, you can see the ridges, you can see the steps. So it makes it so accurate, so easy when you are making your favorite cocktails. And if you do want like a quarter of an ounce or one and three quarter ounces, you know, it doesn't take a, doesn't take a genius to work out where you go for the heart for sort of a, a quarter of an ounce in there. So this is the handled uh, stepped jigger from Barfly. I really like them, but then I get quite sticky fingers. So I'm gonna use these quite a bit. 